Today we're gonna do a quick workout to work on, this is from a client, not me, the jiggly butt area. Now I do have many clients that worry about this. Before we get started, there is no such thing as spot reducing. I am sorry to say. The spot that you want to change the most on your body is probably gonna be the last thing to change. That being said, we can work the muscles around it. So as you, if you have extra weight, as you drop weight, it's gonna be a little bit more firm and defined. But just because we're working on the jiggly butt does not mean the jiggly butt's gonna go away. That has more to do with food than movement. I always have to say that because I don't want to give you the wrong impression. We're gonna start in a plie. Your toes are gonna be out wide, wider, a, a wide spot, and I want the toes up in your shoes. You're pressing down through your heels. I want you to come down and squeeze your butt on the way up. We're gonna stay super slow with these because I really want you to engage those glute muscles. Now, you might be thinking, really? really super slow and controlled is always going to pay off if this is very easy for you you can pause the video and grab a weight and hold the weight here added resistance will always make it a little bit more challenging now when can you see results you got to be consistent first of all and i would say with any strength training program you're looking at four to six weeks of consistent work before you see a change as well as cleaning up your eating habits if your eating habits are not on point. Just two more like that. Remember, you're squeezing your glutes on the way up. You can already feel them lifting, I know it. Now I'm gonna turn this over and do a lunge. With a lunge, I want your body nice and tall. It's easy to go forward, super tall, shoulders back. The weight's gonna be in this front heel. And again, when you come up, I want you to think about squeezing. So my left foot is down. I'm squeezing my left glute on the way up. Again, this is very easy. It is a balance challenge as well. You can always pull the weight here um, to make it a little bit harder. Slow and in control is really what we're looking for. Stay nice and tall. I want your core super tight. We're gonna do two more just like that, and then we'll switch sides. Super fancy turn around. Ready? Super fancy. So now the right toes are up in your shoe. We're coming down and you're squeezing up through that right heel. I talk about balance all the time. My right foot is my weaker side for balance. I'm super wiggly. That is totally normal, just so you know. Keeping that core tight is really gonna help with your balance as well as breathing. We tend to hold our breath. When things are really hard, I want you to keep breathing. We're gonna do two more just like that. Hands can be here, they can be here, whatever works for you. Going back to that plie, keep those toes out, toes out and up in your shoes. Down, squeeze it up. Hands can be here, they can be here, whatever is most comfortable for you. Really important when we're doing any kind of strength work is to do the mind muscle connection. Where do you feel it? really engage those muscles, it does make a difference. When you're drifting off, thinking about going to the grocery store, oh no, no, that is not what we wanna do. You wanna stay focused on the work at hand. Just two more. Now, this is super easy. Again, add the weight, do the video twice. We're going to the lunge. Front toes up, you're squeezing through that left heel. Body stays tall, core is super, super tight. And if you're wiggling, wobbling, me too. Up, think about that left glute. You're squeezing, or you're right, you're on your right. We have three more to go. You're breathing. No holding it by, no pressing your lips. You gotta breathe through this. All right, last time, turn it around. Tall, toes up in your shoes. Squeeze that glute on the way up. I'll put my hands here so you can see and way tall, pressing that heel, not falling over. <laughs> we have three more just like that. Here's three, hang in there. Here's two. And for the final bit of fun, we're gonna get into a little plie, and we're just gonna pulse until we can't pulse anymore, which might be three minutes, it might be five minutes. No, it's not, toes up in your shoes. Quads are probably more in front of anything else. That's totally normal. We're gonna go last four, three, 
two, one, come on up. Thank you so much for your time. Keep moving. If it's easy, do it again. I'll see you next time.